In this video, I will be solving another application problem of differential equations. In this case, we know the marginal revenue. So we know, in case that we know the marginal function, for example, the marginal revenue or the marginal cost or the marginal profit, etc. So we can compute the function. So we can get an expression for the revenue, an expression for the cost, etc., depending on what we have. In this case, we know the marginal revenue. So the marginal revenue in dollars per unit is given by this expression. So the marginal revenue equal 30x divided by 3x squared plus 16,807 to the power 4 over 5. And we need to find the revenue function. So what to do? To get the solution of this problem, so we know the job, we just need to take into account that this marginal revenue is actually the derivative. So the derivative of the revenue respect to the amount of units produced. In this case, it's x. I just type the expression given in the question in this way, and now I'm just going to separate variables, yeah? so I can multiply by dx. So I can say dr, the differential of the, the revenue, equal 30x over 3x squared plus 16,807 to the power 4 over 5 dx, and then get the integral both sides. If I get the integral both sides, what we have is this. This obviously is the revenue, and this will be the integral of this. This integral is not difficult, so you can actually use integral by substitution. May u equal 3x squared plus 16,807. So this will be u to the power 4 over 5. And you will notice that the u will be a factor of this. You can try doing by substitution. It's not difficult. However, I computed using GeoGebra. I just open GeoGebra and type the function in GeoGebra and then use the command integral. This is the result of my GeoGebra window. I type the marginal revenue first, the function that they give me, and then after that I compute the revenue just making the integral of the function that I was given. So when I do that, and I type integral and press enter, this is the answer that GeoGebra gave me. 25 feet root of 3x squared plus 16,807. GeoGebra don't give you the constant of integration. The constant of integration is given here, but I know that will be c. I don't know what number will be the constant of integration. GeoGebra use between negative 5 and 5, the constant of integration. In this case, GeoGebra is using the constant of integration equals 0. But OK, so I know that there is a constant of integration. So the revenue will be 25, the fifth root of 3x squared plus 16,807, plus a constant of integration. And this C, the one that I have to use, is just this, the integration constant. OK, now that we have what is Rx, so I need to know what is this C. But we know something. We know that if you are not producing anything, your revenue will be zero. So if the number of units produced is zero, the revenue will be zero. We can use this fact that we know that if we produce zero units, then the revenue will be zero. So we can substitute x equals zero, and then the revenue will be zero. So if x equals zero, so you are not producing anything, then obviously the revenue will be zero. So if this is, the revenue will be zero, and then we can put a zero here instead of this x. So we have then that zero equals 25 fifth root of three, that multiplies zero squared plus 16,807, plus c. Obviously, this will be the 25, this is 0, this will be 25 multiplied by the fifth root of 16,807. You can use your calculator 
and notice that this is seven. The fifth root of 60,807 is seven. So just 27, 25 times seven, that is 175. So C equal negative 175. So C equal negative 175. And then the revenue will be given by 25 multiplying the fifth root of 3x squared plus 16,807 plus or negative 175. Let's type here the answer. So that will be the expression that defines the revenue in terms of the Unix produce. With this, I have finished my explanation. I hope you have found it useful. Thank you.